Hey guys, Lou here, and welcome back to Banjo Kazooie. First of all, I would like to apologize for not having any episodes for a long time. I've just been school, you know. <laughs> but I was just now looking at the leaderboards of the game, and I actually learned something. I am actually not in the world. <laughs> uh, friends. All right, so game totals. My record for a lot of stuff is pretty impressive. My record for completing the whole entire game is seven hours. Like Mumbo's Mountain, my record is 10 minutes, 25, and it, the times just go up. But then there's like Click Clock Woods, which took me like an hour and 21 minutes. Some guy completed it in 17 minutes. It's crazy. Anyway, let's get into the game. <laughs> All right, so last time, we were playing, I uh, completed Mumbo's Mountain, but not 100%. I forgot to get one item. So we're gonna head back in here and get it. So, if you guys watch, uh, watch back the other episode, I forgot to get the honeycomb piece on top of the jujus. So we're gonna go up there and get it. Alright. Oh, wrong button. Wrong, what? Got it. <laughs> Alright, so what you're supposed to do is jump on top of this guy, and then there's the honeycomb piece. <laughs> so, now we've 100% of the mountain. mountain. I'll leave the level. This camera angle is very strange. Alright, now we've 100 percent in Mumbo's Mountain. Let's check the game totals. Yep, done. 21 minutes. I'm not gonna argue. Alright, so now in that level, we unlock the ability to do this talent shot, which is showing the level you can go up hills. Previously, we couldn't go up here because it would just push you down. Now that we have the talent drop, you can go up it. And there's bottles here and that weird door. This is a note door sealed by Grunty with one of her powerful magical spells. Open it up! Then jam jars. Jam jars again. It's not that simple to open it. You must collect the musical notes from the worlds. How many do we need? The number on the door is the strength of the spell. The combined total of all your best note scores from the worlds must be at least this to- What? I read that right. But anyway, we got all the notes. And this door says 50 on it, so no prob. When you open a world door, I mean, baddies escape and roam once more. I forgot the voice I did for crap. Ugh. That door was easy you got past. Unfortunately, you're first and last. Oh, okay. Oh, hi, stalker. Hello there, young ones. I'm Gruntilda, Gruntilda's nicer sister. I've crept down here to steal you, to help you defeat the old hag. It's about time she was taught a lesson. I know all of Grunty's disgusting secrets, and I'll tell them for three of them every time you find me. Remember them well, young ones, as they will help you avoid a fiery fate. Press X if you'd like to hear them. Sure. Grunty brushes her rotten teeth with salted slug flavor toothpaste. Cool. She also washes her hair with engine oil. Yuck. Cool. Cool, nerd. And she gets her clothes from Saggy Maggy Buddy. Cool. Listen to the music. That's some nice music. Alright, anyway. Now we're in this giant, like, ballroomish thing. It's a giant picture of Gruntilda. I just want to smash it to her face. I want to kill her. Ah, die. Cool. Ah. But we have a couple of things. We have that hole down there. 
This is our first bad guy in the lair. And I rolled into him. Yeah, I got hurt. So I'll take that. And set down these stairs. Oh. You activated a magic cauldron. Find two of the same color to create a shortcut. That was a beautiful voice. Back up the stairs we go. So yeah, that's a shortcut. As he said, if I open like another mentioned one, if I go through him, I'll come out the other one. It's cool. But over, actually, well, yeah. All right, so over here we have this little area where we get a nice remix of Grunty's Lair. Which sounds all piratey. And another painting. Treasure Trove Cove. Let's put the piece. To remove pieces that you've already put down, move the right stick down, but once the picture is complete, all the pieces are stuck there permanently. But as he said, I can move the right stick down, and it takes it. Alright, so there's two pieces to put in, and there you go. Ooh, treasure chest. Treasure Trove Cove. Alright, now I have nine jiggies. Aww. Oh, what's this over here? Ah, this little platform has this. This is a Kazooie shop jump disc. Find me, and I'll tell you how to use it. Go, cool. go, cool, nerd. All right. Grunty admits she's a hog. I really need a big hot dog. Oh. Okay, Grunty. <laughs> All right. Let's head to the next room. Where am I? Ah. Here we are. Let's kill this guy. Whoa. Well, I fell down this area. So might as well go in this door. Huh. Oh, look, there's the treasure chest we opened. Now, time to show off a glitch. My favorite glitch in the whole game. Stand here, crouch, and poop. The eggs get stuck inside to make a glorious noise. <laughs> it's beautiful. Alright, so, let's head on to the second level, Treasure Trove. <laughs> nice music. Yeah! Back to the second level. Ahoy there! This be Treasure Trove Cove. There be two new moves for ye to find. Alright, so right under here you can see there's a Jinjo. Let's jump in again. What the? Snacker smells tasty dinner! I didn't get to finish his law! There's Snackers. He will eat you if you stay in the water for too long. So I need to do... Oh no! We need to get out of here. He's gonna hit us. Alright, so that was a fail. So, I wanna grab this health. Cause, geez, that hurt. And those snippet guys, that's what they're called. Uh, they hurt you for two points. Or two. I mean, wow, I said that right. If you hit them, then they'll give you two, two health back. They take two hits. Got it. Alright, jeez. That guy's a lot harder than he looks to get. So, there's lots of trees here that we can climb up. Where is he? Whee! I'm a red feather! I help Kazooie fly when she knows how! We get to fly? Yeah! Alright, to this next area. Ooh. Hmm. Can't really see it because <laughs> my camera's gotten broken. Let's end this main area here. Ooh, there's a ship. This is cool. Ah, but there's boxes over here. So let's jump up them. And up here, we'll see this guy. Me leaky, no good for water. Can bear a black hole with pebble? Well, I don't have a pebble, but I sure do had a turd. There you go. Vicky patched up. Now empty water for bear. 
How does he have that building? Because once he's patched up, he just instantly drains all the water. All right. Let's go down here. Get these notes. Head inside this little sand castle. Ah. Hey, Furball. You're looking wise. Solve my puzzle and win a prize. Oh no, another rhyme thing? So, if you guys haven't figured it out already, it says Banjo Kazooie on the wall. Hmm. And there's letters on the ground. What you're supposed to do is go around and ground pound all the letters to spell Banjo and Kazooie. Or just Banjo Kazooie. Banjo. Let me find the K. Oh jeez, I always have trouble finding the K. Where is it? Ah. Okay. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You can't use the same one twice. Kaz. Ah, oh, jeez. I can't find that. Oh, wait, no, there's not two Z's in it. Darn it, I'm so good at spelling. Z. Oh. Oh. I'm normally really good at this, but I've forgotten how to spell. E. There we go. The gate opens to reveal your prize. But first, I'll cut you down to size. Wrecked. Re oh, no. You gotta hit him twice. Before I die. That only give me one health. Aw. Hold on. Quickly before we get that jiggy. Let's get these notes. Man, I really need some health. Bottles will heal me. When I get to him. <laughs> I just now tried to do a side flip. <laughs> Yay! Our second jiggy. I mean, first. Yeah! All right, so I just, when I was in there, I just netted this. I was trying to do a side flip. I've been playing a lot of Super Mario 3 World today. So, I'm, yeah, still in that mindset. All right, so let's head back here. Because I actually missed something. Well, I walked past it, rather. All right, so there's bottles. You reached new heights with my shock jump spring. Does Kazooie do it? My legs are tired. Don't worry, the turkey does all the work. Simply stand on the shock jump disc, then press and hold A. Hmm, your injury's low enough. No dir. I'll fill it up for you. Alright, so the shock spring pad. Whee! I can do that. Which, there's actually a mumbo token there. Ikum bokum. Alright. So you guys know it. You guys should know it. What we gotta do is jump between all these platforms, which jump and get these notes. Oh, that was close. I don't really need those red feathers. Because we don't really have the build yet, so it doesn't really matter to me. Let's get up here. And a jiggy! Dun, dun. <laughs> I love that. Now, gotta go back down. No! Poop! <laughs> Quickly, get back up there. Those little clam guys, I forget their name because I'm so professional. And, um, when they hit you, they'll take some of your feathers, eggs, and I think something else. That. I think they might... Oh yeah, they take... No, they don't. I think that's really it. And they might take an item that's shown later. Yay, first Jinjo. Oh no, that's second Jinjo. Cause got one at the beginning. Yep. Ah, snip it. Eh. See, now he dropped two things. The red guy wouldn't. Scared to go on the edge here. I won't go kazoo mode. All right. Oh god, there's honeycomb out there. We'll get that later. I just forgot you can't go from Talentron to a, a 
flutter. Oh jeez. So these treasure chest guys, their teeth will hurt you if you try to get inside. And they eat you so you can't get out. Threatening. So uh Oh wait, health, 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 health. I normally don't play this badly. I guess I just haven't played the game for a while, so. No. No. Alright, we'll go to that little area later. And we'll go on the ship later. So I skipped a little portion I want to go to. It's so hard because in Banjo Vasui, there's so much to explore. So you never know what you want to do first. My way of doing this is just standing here. And doing the cross wipe. Because if I don't, I just start glitching out on the tree. It's mainly because of me. Alright. Next area is over here. That giant menacing cloud thing. Hey, this is Nipper's Beach. You're high. <laughs> you find nothing with Nipper's help. Help us th oh. <laughs> Guard, cheeky bird need feather clipping. Oh yeah? Just try it, Shellhead. I did the same voice for both of them. So he grabs at me a little bit, and then you have to go in and hit him in the face. Three, four. One, two, three, four. Done. And then he just crawls back into his hole. If someone can enter his hole. I'm trying to figure out his shell is really, really big. And now we're in here. Wish there's one big guy, shoot Dakus! Ow! Session. All right. Uh, so that's really all doing a shell, but I like to point out that he's gone. Like he crawled back inside his shell, and now he's just completely gone. So that means that we killed him. Sorry for the dogs. They're very loud. They're very, very loud. Hold on. I'll be back. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little episode. Sorry I had to end it so... Well, I guess this is a long episode. But I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little episode. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!